Welcome back to more Harvest Moon 3D, a new beginning, everybody. In the last episode, we met the Harvest Goddess. Pretty interesting, right? Alright, so in this episode, um, obviously I don't have any crops, as you already know. It's actually been a few days since I last recorded, so I'm trying to figure out what the fuck did I do and what I didn't do. Like, did I attend my cow, for example? Well, my cow has no food here, so I'm assuming that I haven't done shit today. So let's go ahead and take care of that, you know? There we go. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and put that away. Looks nice and healthy today. Cool. Alright, so here's the brush. Today's gonna be a good day, people. And not just a good day, but a good video. I have a I have a feeling, you know, I have a really great feeling. I just feel it. But yeah, apparently I haven't done anything today. Cause, Cause I think the last thing that I actually did then in that case was that I went to the um uh, harvest goddess and meet the harvest goddess and then that was actually it for the video so that means that today I haven't done anything else all right let's go and grab this sickle here and basically just cut down one of every single one of these of course I'm getting a eight eight of them but you get five feedings like that's freaking awesome that one father gives you five full feeds you know that's really cool because that means that you don't actually have to spend so much time or resources you know on this because you're well fed, like your animal's gonna be well fed for a long time. Now with chickens, it unfortunately works a lot differently. Sad to say. But yeah. Um, Alright, that's basically it for that. I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and go over to, um, <clears throat> over to the town. I mean, really, actually not the town. Um, more so just, do I have to ship anything? I think I do. Yeah, by the way, there's some research, and yes, um, you will actually get access to the bigger bag on summer day one if you want to do that, which I, I'm i going to do it, that's for sure. See, I really should have deposited. I, I can only carry 10 things, unfortunately. How much do fish traps sell for? 70 each? That's a little tempting, to be honest. Hmm. Well, I'm just going to... You know what, I want to take a look at the the blueprints, but I forgot what time all this is actually opened. So for all I know, it could be closed. I don't know, is it open or closed? I must know. What? Oh crap. Let me look at the sign. Oh, it's early anyway, I'm so stupid. Okay, move, move, move. Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday from 10 to 6. So today's actually Friday, which means that it is in fact open, so that'll work, but um, I just have to um, wait a little bit. So in that case, I'm going to come over here and basically go ahead and get some um, get some foraging done, you know? Oh my god. Got some honeycomb, that's nice. Uh, what about... Mm, nothing really there, that's a bird, of course. There's a nice, nice little butterfly like that. Anything over here? <clears throat> I don't really know. There are some stuff here. Nice. Honeycomb, small branch, small rock, another small rock. Speaking of small rocks and small branches, once again, I gotta emphasize, um, in this game, you don't want to chop them or destroy them all right away because there are some things that require branches or rocks rather than you know, lumber. So because of that, you could screw it up because you can't go that that way. Like, you could always keep the, the branches and the rocks and then smash them, smash any number of them whenever you need them. You can go that way, but you can't go back the other way. So it's better to just keep them like that and then smash as many as you need for, like, a build, you know? And that's it. If you could go back and forth, and, like, interchangeably, then okay, cool. It makes sense that you could just chop them if you want to, you know? But no, that's not possible. Also, one more thing I should mention is that I'm going to actually start collecting weeds. You do actually need weeds for something in this game. Um, kind of kind of stupid, but, but yeah, you do need them. So now's a good time to start collecting them. Um, I believe by this point I can't really carry much else. As you just saw, I'm up there in inventory, so I really can't. I got a spotted ladybug at least. Hmm... There's some flowers, honeybee, that's cool. Let's see if there's anything else over here. Some mushrooms, poison, yeah, so they do actually grow, as you can see. 
Well, that's nice, I suppose. <clears throat> okay. Well, I'm out of here. There's actually people here. Look at that on the map. Wow. I'm about to meet them right now. Not enough space for that. Or that. Jesus. I can get, get the bush brown at least and the magic blue flower. Okay. That's cool. Hello, Iroha. Are there any weeds? Usually there are. Oh, here's Tony. Uh, can I cannot grab that either. I can grab this though, right? Oh, I just found a ladybug, spotted ladybug? Oh my god. Okay. Whatever you say, game. Whatever you say. I, mean, I don't know. Shit. Okay, so... Anything else over here? There's this. That's a spotted ladybug. Look at that. That's awesome. Do I dare go all the way? Ugh. Here's that. I mean, I do kind of want to do this, you know? Like, to go all the way... Hmm. Oh my god, I need this stuff. This is really valuable. What am I going to throw away? Um. Maybe this? You know what, I'm going to discard that, sure. Let's discard that. Um. I have to discard one more thing, though. Am I about to discard a bug? I don't want to discard the weeds. Man. I really don't want to. I'm gonna have to discard a bug, unfortunately. Here, discard that. Also, one other thing that you should be doing, and I'm gonna start doing that today, actually, is, well, I'm gonna go all the way across first and forage everything, but one big thing that you really wanna start doing is uh, befriending um, the girl that will, what the hell was that animal doing? Did you see that? Why are they so fast? What the heck? Y'all are crazy. Okay, I actually just discarded that. I can grab that one at least. That's a dirt grasshopper. Um, anything over here? Nope. Alright, but I'm gonna get on this mushroom. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and go over to, um... Oh god, I forgot her name. Holy shit, this is so bad. She's not there anymore! What the heck? Where did she go? Dude! Dude! This isn't good, man. She just, like, left. Like, what the heck? <clears throat> okay, fine. Fine, I'm gonna try and find her then. She must be at her house, right? She must be. Yeah, she is. I figured as much, so let's go ahead and um, take care of that. So, I'm sorry, I kept getting distracted and not actually finishing my sentence, but one thing you want to do is actually start befriending her. Um, oh, she's eating. It's so hard to track characters in this freaking game. This is crazy. God damn it, man. It's like people are never available in this game, you know? It's because also their lunch is literally for two freaking hours. Like, that's... Who the fuck has lunch for two hours? Everybody knows that lunch is supposed to be an hour thing. Also, one thing I really have to do is move these buildings closer to the entrance because... I'm, I'm wasting a whole lot of time just walking over to these buildings and that's not really good, you know? All right, so I need to see what you got here. Let's see. You actually don't have what I thought you would have. How do I um, how do I unlock those honeybee things? Hmm. I don't know. That's a little weird, but okay. Um, <clears throat> I guess the last thing I will do is just simply wait. Until 2. I'm pretty sure you'll be done with lunch at 2, right? Because, see, characters will not accept gifts when they're eating. They really won't, so... There you are, perfect. Okay. Okay. What I'm gonna do... Is reach into my bag. So this girl... She loves... Like, scrap metals and stuff, so I'm gonna go ahead and hold this. And I'm gonna give it to you. There you go. You can only give one gift per day. Um, but it is incredibly convenient to do what I just did because if you befriend Iroha, um, over time you're going to be getting blueprints for tools, actually. <clears throat> and you need upgraded tools if you want to have any success in this game. Um, axes will let you destroy those other trees that are blocking. 
The hammer will let you mine for better items. The watering can just speeds up the process for, you know, watering, of course. What the heck? Emma, what you doing here? I mean, it's nice seeing you here, don't get me wrong, but what the heck? Okay. Well, I'm actually done for today. Oh, I should have, you know what, whatever. I was like, I should have shipped some stuff, but... By this point, who even cares? Who the fuck cares? Okay. So I received 280G. Did I ship stuff? Oh, I did. Yeah, that's right, I did. Alright, so today's the 28th of spring, and to be honest, I don't want to forage because I am struggling so much. You know, with um, just making it by here uh, with 30 slots. So what I have to do is wait for the first of summer and actually buy a freaking bag, you know? I have to do that. Also, wait, are there 30 days in spring or 31? <clears throat> There's 30, right? There's no harvest wing as I put 31 days, or is there? I might be wrong, but hmm, I could have sworn that there wasn't. He's eating. Alright, where is my... <clears throat> I always cycle the wrong way, man, I'm stupid. Okay, so here I'm brushing my cow. And then time for the milker. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me, dude? This is so stu- Oh my god, I'm, I'm just glad that I'm freaking two days away. Man, 30 slots in your bag is nothing in this game. This is crazy. Like, I literally can't even milk my cow because of this bullshit limitation, you know? What the heck? My god. Like, should I get rid of some tools that I don't use? I mean, the problem is I use everything. I guess I can get rid of fertilizer, because I'm not really gonna- that's kind of wasting some spot. You know what? Here, I don't think I'm gonna be using that in a long time, so... Get rid of that, that saves the space. These, I need to put them all in the, you know... I need to deposit all those. I'm just gonna go ahead and ship all these bugs. Except honeybees. I mean, I don't think I need that many honeybees regardless, but... You know, still. Okay, I got rid of some stuff. So now I'm gonna go back and milk my cow this time. As you can see, I'm just trying to get over. I'm, I'm trying to get past spring, man. I, I need it to be summer. I need a bunch of good stuff to start happening. All right, let's try this again. There we go. Perfect. All right, so now, um. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep going in the days, like, just keep progressing them, you know? Alright, so I'm gonna put a bunch of stuff into storage. Basically, things that I don't need. I'm gonna put all the fodder in there. Uh, I'm gonna put my honeybees in there. I suppose I can put the weeds in there, sure. You know what, I'm also gonna- I'm not gonna be fishing for a while, so I'm gonna put the fish traps in there, because that's also wasting a spot. Put the flowers, honeycombs... That's about all I can do for that. Um, and then for this... I'm gonna keep that one, um, because that's gonna be up upcoming anyway. I'll keep the milk, and I'll put the walnuts in there. Okay. Cool, now I should have a lot of space, right? How much space do I have? 14, okay, I got 16 spots. Still not a whole lot, but, I mean... You gotta work with, with, with what you got, right? Alright, I just made 340 more, so it's spring 29, um... Damn, you know? I'm really thinking of what I should do here. You know what, I'm just gonna start with my cow because I already have the inventory there of brush and milker, like, by default. So I might as well take care of the cow first. Also, this is kind of weird, but it's kind of random that the brush is blue in this game. <laughs> Like, in most games, it's brown, you know? It, it really is. I'm not, I'm not even kidding you. It really is. Like, it's brown, you know? And this game, they just made it blue. I'm like, okay, cool, whatever. Whatever, man. Alright, so time to go ahead and cut all this... Oh, shit, I missed. How do you miss cutting grass, dude? Are you stupid? 
And by you, I mean myself. Because <laughs> obviously my character doesn't have any power in that, you know? I control my character. Alright. Two more and it's gonna... Oh my... You know what, that's fine. That's... Oh my god, how did I do that? Honestly, it's fine though. I mean, the grass is gonna die in like... 10 days anyway. God damn it. How did I accidentally do that? Oh my... This is why you want to be careful, people. This is why you want to be incredibly careful. I just cut a freaking grass that I should not have. Oh my god. Like, am I stupid or what? Jesus. Alright, so now it's the 30th. Which means that it is in fact a festival today. Um, but what time do I have to make it over there? I actually have no idea. Like, I'm pretty sure it's... Like 10? <clears throat> or something? Maybe? I don't know. Either way, I mean, I need to do all this first anyway, so... I'll go ahead and take care of all that first. Okay. Got that, and I'm gonna come in here. Hello again, cow. Alright, so... Brush. And milker. Let's do this. You know, honestly, you have to use a pitchfork a lot less in this game than Story of Seasons. Or at least Trio of Towns. I can't speak for the original Story of Seasons, the one that came out in 20... Was it 2014 or 2015? 2015, I think. Trio of Towns came out in 2017. I do know that. Okay. So let's go in here, let's see what we got. Hmm. Okay, seriously, when is the... I don't know. Like, I actually have no freaking clue. Should I, like, go back and check? It's on the 30th, right? Not the 31st. Am, am I being... Oh, my God. I have to check. I can't believe I have to go back in my house and check this shit. My calendar. Oh, boy. All right, let's see what it says. Oh, my God, there are 31 days. Starts at 12 p.m. at the festival grounds. Okay. Well. That's interesting, so I have to oh, I have to wait until 12, which, well, you know what that means. Time to forage. I gotta kill time anyway, so... If I need to kill time, I might as well go out and forage. And because it's been a few days since I last foraged... Um, I, I don't know if it's true, but it feels true. Like, you know, if it's been a few days and there's gonna be more stuff ready to pick up... It might be true. I mean, look at it. There's already three stuff here in the very beginning. Like, that's crazy, you know? Also, I didn't put the other stuff in the storage outside, you know, like the materials and shit. Whoops, I should have done that. Oh, damn. Look at this. This is a lot of stuff. And also, I, yeah, I do need to get into the habit of actually giving, um, the girl a gift every single day. Even if I don't forge, I still have to go out of my way and start giving her a gift. Very important. Alright, so I'm just gonna hop over all that stuff. What's over here? Anything? Honeybee? Hmm, look at that by the way. You see that? Looks like a little warp, huh? Hmm. I mean, maybe. Alright, first area is done. Second area. That's what we can grab from here. A mint. A small branch. Uh, nothing there actually. Okay. That's a little interesting. Usually there is something there. Hey, 
any second now, though, it's gonna be like, your bag is full. The freaking alert I get every damn day. Hmm, a honeycomb. Okay, another one. Yeah, the thing about honeycombs is that they don't actually grow in the summer. Yeah, you're gonna need them in the summer. That's the biggest reason why I kept saying, like, hey, make sure that, you know, that you get this stuff in the spring. Incredibly important to do so. And you'll be seeing why very shortly, actually. Yeah, once summer starts, it's basically like the game really speeding up in terms of, like, what we're doing. Uh, spring has been pretty slow for the most part. It really picked up by the 25th once the blueprints actually became available. There it is, there's that message already. That was a weed? Yeah, it was. Okay. There's a honeycomb. Ooh, a few more weeds there, nice. Another butterfly, bush brown. And bag is full. Okay, well... I really don't want to explore the entire forest, but I mean, maybe I should for the materials at least, like the, you know, ore and shit, if I could get that, that'd be nice. And I mean, I guess all this stuff, if I have space for it, why not, right? I don't have space for that, or the walnut either. Neither of those. That kind of sucks. There's a honeybee, I can grab that at least. Grab mushrooms. Another one of these, oh, that one is actually, okay, that's not a bush brown, it looks like a bush brown. And this one I can never grab. There's some more ore, nice. Or, I mean, a scrap metal, but I basically just call that ore, like everything. Everything that's like a material that can be mined for. I have a habit of saying that, you know? Not a bush brown. Okay, that's a small branch. Okay, I can't grab those things though, unfortunately. Can I grab that? Nope. Nothing. Alright, we're done. Uh, so it's 11.26 actually, it's gonna start in very soon, but in the meantime, I'm gonna head on over here, I, I want to talk to you. Hello you. Yes, I believe so. Let's go to bag, and uh, I'm gonna grab this thing here, I'm gonna go ahead and put hold. Oh my freaking... You stupid character, man. Oh. What is this? Copper sickle blueprints. Look at that. See? Receive copper. What the heck? Nice. You give me all that shit? That's awesome. That is awesome, girl. I love that. Okay, well. But that's what I'm basically talking about. You know, if you keep doing that, then yes, good things will actually happen. Um, I guess... Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna... 12. It's freaking 12. What do I do now? Do I have to leave and go back in? I'm so confused. Let me see. Maybe I do, actually. Dun, dun. Wait, I'm so confused. What am I doing wrong? What? Wait, what's going on? Did I miss something? What? Um... Where's Dunhill? Okay, I am so confused. Also, yeah, Dunhill is in fact missing. Where the hell is that guy? He's not in my ranch at all. I am incredibly confused. Um, Alright, everybody, so I just figured this out. The Festival Grounds is actually a place that I haven't been to yet. It's over here. I'm so dumb. I am so dumb. Oh my god. I thought it was a place... Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright. If you want to participate, grab a, cro uh, grab a crop harvested in spring and come talk to me. So I have to pull it out? Yeah, but this is where it's at. Oh my god, I'm so... Damn it, I can't believe that. Do not eat it. Oh my freaking god. 
You don't have any room in your bag. I can't give you any prizes unless you... Are you... S oh my god. I need to hurry up because it's going to be until... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Run, dude. This is such, this is such bullshit, man. If oh my god. I'm just glad that I am almost done with spring. Like, this is ridiculous. This whole, like, lack of space everywhere, you know? You just sell everything. I think that's all I need to get rid of. For now, at least. Okay. So... Run, run, run. Hurry up. Got it. Oh yeah, I knew. God damn it. Okay, do not eat the thing. Be very careful. Hold. Got it. Take this. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna enter, um, participating. I'm gonna go into beginner's class, obviously. Beginner's class, participate. Okay. Let's go. Wow, it's cool, is not Crop festival. Let's start the spring crop festival, okay? Please say hello to our four contestants. Entry number one. Alright. And entry number two. Matter farm. And then Shmoo farm. <laughs> what the fuck kind of names are these, man? Okay. Emma. Alright, let's do this. So I brought my potato with one and a half stars. So if you bring a crop with one and a half stars, I believe you win. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. I'm not sure. I did win. Cool. There we go. That's why you want to use fertilizer to win the beginner class. The second place is Kagamaru, third is Momiji, uh, fourth is Eldridge. Time for the award ceremony. Okay, cool. Here are your prizes. Turnip seeds and starter recipes three and chicken statue blueprints. Whoa. Chicken statue. <laughs> That's funny. Why, thank you. Look at those rewards. That's freaking awesome. Your vegetable brand is now an unknown brand. Keep aiming... Why is it called unknown? Basically, your brand increased, so... Compared to when you had no brand, stand your vegetable shipping prices have gone up by 20%. Well, that's good. Now I can make more of that monies, you know? Cool. This concludes. Yes, it does. Oh, that's it? Cool. I guess I can talk to people now. So there's Tony. And here's Iroha. Possibly. I mean, yeah, it might help, right? Um, here's Dunhill. Got it. Okay, I'm just, oh my god, I gotta talk way too much. I don't really think I have to talk to all these people, though. You only know about animals. Yeah, there's a lot of people here. I mean, it's cool that there's actually a lot of villagers now, you know? And then those are like generic people, I suppose. Um, oh my god, wait, what the heck? Oh, shoot. Uh, return home? Yes. Hopefully I didn't miss anything there. Alright, well that's gonna be about it. Um, I guess I'll just go ahead and go to bed. And... I guess tomorrow, because isn't it the flower festival? I think it is. But here's the thing, you don't really need to do shit for this festival. Like, you really don't. Because it's... It, it's kind of like the other one, this really stupid one. This one. <laughs> of just giving gifts to people. It's kind of stupid, to be honest, but yeah. Well, I guess I'll just go ahead and end it here. So, um... If you enjoyed this episode in any way, please be sure to leave a like. I'd appreciate it very much. Thank you. And as always, I will see you all next time. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a great and a fantastic day.